Hi everyone, it's Nicole here, Noisy Astronomer. I am on vacation, but I wanted to bring a quick uh, science demo called Pocket Solar System. This is a really easy one. All you need is a length of long paper, so register tape works well. Um, paper streamers work well as well. We just did a demo of this at Convergence. Uh, so you get a length of paper. And what you're going to do is make a pocket solar system out of it. At the very basics, you just need a marker or a pen, but stickers work too. And what you want to do is get people to first guess where on this long strip the planets would be if you put the sun, whoops, the sun at one end, and on the other end, you have Pluto. Yes, I know. Pluto controversy, but this original demo uses Pluto, so we're going to go ahead with that. Now to show where the planets actually are, what you do is you fold this register tape in half, so increase it, open it up, and in that middle crease is the planet Uranus. So we'll put a U for Uranus. Okay. So we have the Sun at one end, Uranus in the middle, Pluto at one end. We fold it in half again, fold it in half one more time, increase it. So now it's folded in four, in two fourths. On the crease closest to the Sun is Saturn. So right, Saturn. Again, little circle stickers work well. Uranus. And out here, three quarters of the way, is Neptune. Put an N for Neptune. Okay. So we have the Sun, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune, and Pluto, the dwarf planet at the end. So now, you can look at the first quarter. It's where the rest of the planets are going to go. You fold the Sun up to Saturn. Make a crease. So that halfway point between the Sun and Saturn is Jupiter. So now we've got all the gas and ice giants, and we've filled up much of the register tape. Next thing you do is you take the Sun, fold it over to Jupiter, and in that crease you can put the asteroid belt. All the little dots of the asteroid belt. So we've got this whole piece of register tape and the distances of the planets to scale. And the inner solar system is just this little bit here. You can fold over again the sun to the asteroid belt and crease it. And about there is the planet Mars. Now at this point, you've got just a little bit left. But as you can see, I didn't cut it too evenly to start with. Um, and so Mercury, Venus, and Earth. Venus and Earth are all kind of jammed in in that early piece. Okay, so uh, that is our pocket solar system. That is a really quick and easy demonstration of the distances, the relative distances of the planets in the solar system.